Good morning, Quadcopter 101, and I have a neat new um, micro FPV racer that I wanted to show you today. This is the ET or the ET115 PMP version. Uh, notice uh, this also comes in available in ET100 and ET125. I decided to pick the one in the middle to review. <laughs> it comes with a very nice carrying case, by the way, as you notice here. I just wanted to show you the carrying case before we open it up and show you the quadcopter. Um, this is the 115. The 115 comes with a 800 TVL camera, 16 channel FPV transmitter. Now the FPV transmitter on this is down here in the bottom. You might think that this is the uh, the receiver for the quadcopter. It is not. It is the transmitter for the FPV transmitter. So you can change the channels of the transmitter easily via this button here. The receiver itself is located inside the quadcopter and to get in there to bind it you are going to need to remove the t this top off the quadcopter by removing these three screws here this one this one and this one the Phillips screws and then you can remove the top and lift it off to uh, access the bind uh, plug on the transmitter now this runs off of PicoBlocks uh, 3.1.6 Betaflight. So, you know, it's relatively new Betaflight. Not the newest, but relatively new. Uh, we'll see how well it performs with it. But it also comes with 4-in-1 ESCs, uh, 10 amp ESCs, BL Hell ES ESC. Um, also, a, a 7,500 kV motors here. Actually, pretty nice looking motors. XT1104, uh, 7,500 kV motors. Uh, what am I missing? It has a beeper available in uh, Futaba, FreeSky, FlySky, and DSM. And finally, it comes with a nice, nice battery. Let me get it out of the case here. Notice this case has slots to hold the batteries and other available slots if you want to add more batteries in there. But it comes with a nice 550 milliamp per hour 80C slash 160C uh, motor, 2S uh, 7.4 volt motor. So it should run for quite a long time. I hope it will. We'll have to find out here shortly. Uh, I will be flying it today with my jumper set to DSM-2 since I have the DSM-2 version. Uh, so let's go fly it and see how it performs. Hope you enjoy this flight. We're going to start off by flying it first in uh, angle mode and line of sight. So hope you enjoy the flight. Okay, we're going to start off in angle mode and line of sight. Select, selecting arm. Notice that the motors run while it's in arm. Wow. A lot of, a lot of punch. <laughs> it seems to have a lot of punch. That's a heck of a lot of punch, surprisingly. Oh, oh, oh I'm, I'm excited. Wow. Punchy little thing. Let's do that one more time. <laughs> wow. This is going to be exciting. Okay, let's bring it in and land it, and then we're going to go right into acro flying. Hope you enjoy the second part of this flight. Okay, disarming. I'm excited. Let's see how it performs. <laughs> it looks cool. Okay, selecting uh, uh, acro, and then selecting arm. We are in acro. Let's go up and see how it performs. Okay, do a do a roll around the area first. Going down there. Going up. Oh, it does that nicely. Well, very nicely, actually. Oh. <laughs> My brother-in-law thought I was, he was going to have to go running after it. No, yeah, no, I got it. I got it. I never crash. <laughs> okay, I got it set for 25 uh, milliwatts, the, the transmitter. Um, I, it's 25 and 200, I believe, is selectable. But I, I got it set for low, low power. Give me a little more flight time, hopefully. So let's go around the trees. It maneuvers very nicely through the trees. Okay, let's let's see about getting some speed on it. I'm going around the trees one more time. Going around this way. I'm going up again and doing a loop or a roll. 
coming around this way. So yeah, this is a nice flyer with a lot of punch. Coming back down. I'm getting beeps already on that. Hold on, let's land it for a second. I want to see what that beep is. Okay, let's go back in the air. This time I'm going to select air mode. Okay, air mode is selected. And arming. Let's see if we got a difference here. I still had more power on left on that battery, so I was mistaken. Going up. But I do hear it's beeper. So. Okay, if I level off, I don't hear the beeper. Oh, no, I do hear it's beeper. So let's go up again one more time. Oh, no, I got another battery. I'm going to plop another battery in this, folks, because I want to get, get another flight out of it. We're going to land it because the beeper's going off. But uh, we're going to land it, and we'll plop another battery in. I got a little uh, 450. Not the 550, but the 450. And let's try 450 in this. Okay, I got a 450 milliamp per hour in there, ADC battery. Let's see how that works with a 450. I'm going, I want to be in air mode again. And arming. Let's try maneuverability this time. Yeah, I wish I would, I should have set it to 200 mil, or, well, even 200 milliwatts. I don't, It's, it's maneuverable. <laughs> One above. It likes to do rolls. It really does. Does them well. Coming down, coming down, coming down. Going around. Going around. Coming down, coming down. Going by us. Going around us. So it's, this is a nice little quad. It's not super zip. Well, it's got a lot of punch. Got a lot of punch. But the camera angle, uh, you're gonna have to need to modify it somehow if you wanna do high speed runs with it. Because uh, I'm looking at the ground quite a bit here and lifting my head up trying to get high speed out of it. There we go, you know, it's gotta push the uh, horizon to the ground to get speed out of it. And I don't like to do that. There we go, that's its speed. But the beeper's going off already on this little 450. So I gotta think about changing it. <laughs> you can do lazy rolls with this thing. Lazy rolls. Okay. Yeah, but my beeper's going off. So I'm gonna land it too. Let's bring it in, bring it in. Bring it over. See how close I can get on the pad this time. Oh, I did it. <laughs> okay. Landed right on the pad. That's a rarity. So, that's the ET-115. Neat little quadcopter. Uh, you could actually fly this indoors, too. And it's well protected for indoors uh, with these rings around it. You know, So it's meant for indoor and outdoor flying, too, if you, if you wish. So, hope you enjoyed this flight of the ET-115. This is Quadcopter 101. Let's hold it up for a nice uh, selfie. Quadcopter 101, signing out. Not selfie, uh, thumbnail. Bye-bye. <laughs>